Hey guys, welcome back. Time for a new project here on the channel. So I finally decided to dig out this 67 Impala that I've had in the stash for, God, going on close to two years, I think. But it's the uh, the Supernatural from AMT. Repop Air by uh, Round 2. But I don't want to Impala... I'm going to try to make a cop car out of this. So that means you have to add the uh, the frames. You have to add the B pillar, you know, in, the, in your frames around your doors. And I've already got that accomplished. I put on new uh, rain gutter trim on it because what was on there was, it was hit or miss. Some of it was sharp as a razor and some of it was not even there so i just went in and sanded it smooth and used some uh, 30 by 30 on that and then rounded the edges over a little bit not a whole lot but uh one thing i have done to it though this this kit comes as an impala which means it has this fancy side trim on the bottom well for your bel air and your biscayne you didn't have that so I went ahead and removed it on the passenger side I uh, went downstairs about an hour ago wet sanded it real good and I'm gonna have to get the other side to this level and give me a real light mist coat of primer on it to see where I stand but it, it's it doesn't feel too bad right now I had to rescribe in the door lines they don't look too awful bad. But one one thing about this kit, and it I don't know. I don't know if I if I have the ability to do this or not, but th this car came in, in three trim levels. Your top level was the Impala, then your next one down was the Bel Air, and then your last uh, trim level was the Biscayne, which was your, uh, your, just your basic four door car, you know, no, no frills. The, the things you would have found in a, in a cop car, um, uh, you know, a taxi cab, something like that. And this car, here's the, the rear bumper to it. It's got the tail lights in it. Well, the Impala, and the Bel Air both shared the same taillight group with the, the two red uh, taillights on either side of the clear reverse lights. Now, the only big difference between that and the Bel Air, or the Biscayne, I should say, was the Biscayne only had two. And let me set this tripod down and We'll talk about that for a minute. So if you look at the, the car here that I pulled up, this is a 67 Biscayne, which is the, the bottom level trim on this car. And you'll notice that you have the bumper and then your, your taillights setting right up above it. Well, on the kit part, you know, you got the bumper in your tail lights, and you have this nice chrome trim work around it. That's not on the bottom line Biscayne. So I would have to cut all of this out and then remove the portion. Let me get up a little closer. If I remove the portion of the uh, reverse light, and then squeeze these two together a little bit like they are here. I mean, it looks simple enough to cut this out, cut it right through here, just trim all that off, then cut the tail lights out. You could use a piece of 10 thousandths styrene right here, shape it in there, and then just 
glue these two ends separately. I mean, it wouldn't be an absolute ton of work, but if you start cutting on this and you make a mistake, then I think you might be, you might be in trouble. Uh, I do have the, the two door version in the closet, but I don't know if I want to maybe waste my time and sacrifice that just for a bumper if I happen to screw this one up. But I've been doing some, some Google searches and I do believe, and I know everything you see online, you can't always believe, but I think I can probably get away with, with making a Bel Air out of this, getting rid of all this, this trim down here. Let me back up a little bit more. Get rid of all this trim like I've done on this side. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not going to be cutting any doors open or anything. This would be a real, real good kit. It'd be similar to the van I just finished. Most of the details will be on the body. Of course, it comes, uh, it does come with a nice engine and a pretty detailed uh, frame and body. So we'll be able to do some good detail work on that. But this is going to be our next project here on the channel. And right, wrong, or, or indifferent, that's, that's what I'm going to build. A 67 Bel Air cop car. I don't know what agency I'm going to build yet. I need to sort through my decals I have, see what I got. <coughs> Excuse me, see if I've got, see what decals I have and then get online again and see if I have something that matches what I can find online for 67. But I was, oh, I was gonna do uh, a Wisconsin car, but I only have one set of decals, and as you can see, they're stuck on this one, and this this car kind of took a dump on me. I wound up using parts on it on other things, so, you know, it is what it is. But this is what we're going to be doing next. I hope you guys uh, watch, and uh, hopefully I'll have something more to add to this tomorrow. So until then, I'll see you in the next video.